The Tampa Bay Buccaneers look to remain undefeated against the winless Denver Broncos in Week 3. We'll break it down for you with a money-making opportunity on a player prop. Hi, I'm Steve Seagrave from SportsBemo.com. I also have a great promo code to share with you guys towards the end of the video. Save you some money on an NFL season pass. But for now, if you guys enjoy the content, hit the like button. Subscribe to the Wager Talk channel and let us know in the comments section who do you got in week three. Whether it's a side, a total, or player prop, I'll be checking those comments and responding back to you guys. So right out of the gate, I need to apologize for any background noise you guys might be hearing. I'm having some work done on my roof and they are causing quite a racket right now. Unfortunately, there isn't uh, too much I can do about it. So we'll just work through this video. If you could just bear with me, I would appreciate it. But we got the Denver Broncos at the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Kickoff on Sunday afternoon, 1 p.m. from Raymond James Field. Bucks find themselves as six and a half point home favorites with the total sitting at 41. Tampa Bay, as we already mentioned, is 2-0 on the year. They're coming off a big 20-16 victory on the road in Detroit against the Lions. However, their defense is dealing with some key injuries. Antoine Winfield Jr., the safety, has already been ruled out. Defensive tackle Kalia Kansi has already been ruled out. And Vita Vey, the defensive tackle, is, question is currently questionable right now. On the other side of things, we've got Denver Broncos on the other side of the spectrum at 0-2. They're coming off a 13-6 loss against the Pittsburgh Steelers. Uh, rookie quarterback Bo Nix has a completion percentage under 60%. He hasn't thrown a touchdown pass yet, and he has thrown four interceptions. However, we are going to be looking his way on an over for our play for this video. We're going to be looking at his over in passing yards. It's a very low number at 186 and a half. Now, Nix had 246 passing yards last week despite playing a strong Steelers defense. He only had 138 in week one in his rookie's first game on first off. And then he was also playing a brutal Seahawks pass defense that ranks number two right now in yards allowed. However, the other quarterback they did face was Jacoby Brissett. But Mike McDonald, uh, we know him from the Ravens. He's got a strong defense over there right now. In Seattle now now though Knicks is going to be facing a Buccaneers team that ranks 28th in drop back su success rate so far this season they just allowed Lions quarterbacks uh, Goff did the majority of this damage to throw for 324 yards last week another rookie Jaden Daniels only recorded 184 so he Daniels fell a couple yards short of this total in week one However, we already mentioned how this Tampa Bay defense is banged up, and this game script is going to have the Broncos. They don't have much of a running game, and uh, as nearly a touchdown underdog, they're going to be throwing through the majority of this game. They're going to need Knicks to fire away here, and uh, I, this seems like a very low total for a game where they're going to be playing from behind and trying to keep up with this potent Buccaneers offense. So official play for the video. Let's go with the rookie. In his third game, Bo Nix, over 186 passing yards. Guys, if you want to save some money on an NFL season pass, use the code NFL50. It gets you $50 off uh, the rest of my NFL season. It works for uh, college football as well, CFB50. And if you were to use FBALL100, FBALL100, it gets you $100 off a combo of both of those sports. Uh, we're in action in both of those sports this weekend, a 5% play in the NFL, and I'm always in action in the MLB as well. Uh, we got WNBA player props for the postseason coming up as well. There's a link to my Sports Memo page in the pinned comment. I always have free plays posted at sportsmemo.com as well as over at X at Steve's Book 22. Sorry about the background noise. If you guys enjoyed the video, Hit the like button on the way out, and I will see you guys next week.